Hello and welcome back to my vlog. Today is Vlogtober Day 5. We're doing pumpkin cheesecake pillow poppers. You're going to start off with two 8 ounce packages of Philly cream cheese softened. You're going to add in one half cup of sugar. As well as two more teaspoons of sugar. Gonna beat those together until it's nice and fluffy. From there you add one egg. Two cups of pumpkin puree. Two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Two teaspoons of pumpkin pie spice. If you don't have pumpkin pie spice, that mix is two teaspoons of cinnamon, one quarter teaspoon allspice, one half teaspoon nutmeg, and one half teaspoon ginger. You're going to blend that all together. You're going to cover it and put it in the fridge to chill. Spray some muffin pans and set those aside. What you're going to need is crescent roll cans the sheet crescent roll, not the ones that already have the perforated strips, because you're going to cut them in three by four inch squares or rectangles. They don't have to be as exact. You will have some extra dough. You're going to put the dough in the muffin pan and push it down a little bit in the center. Get the pumpkin mix that you just made from the fridge and you're going to put a little bit on the inside of each dough and then you're going to pinch the edges together as well as up the sides so that the pumpkin does not come out and if you need to twist the tops You're going to turn your oven to 375 Fahrenheit and put them in the oven. For about 10 to 14 minutes. When done, let them cool for 5 minutes and remove them from the pan. Sprinkle powdered sugar on top. Sprinkle cinnamon on top and put a little caramel 
ice cream topping on top. This can also be served with vanilla ice cream. There you have it, pumpkin cheesecake pillow poppers. Thank you for joining today. Uh, leave a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't, and please ring that bell.